Welcome back to Legendary Buffy, where we're trying to beat Angelus, her angel gone bad, and we're playing Road to Damnation. All right, player one, of course, first thing we do is we have a villain card come out, because, yeah, uh, oh, it's another angel card, advance the light. All right, this is all going to shove down, uh, and we are in the light right now, so what's nice about this is this is a five and a two to take out. Uh, so let's see what we have for player one. We have a two, four, we have five attack without doing anything. We've got no synergies. We basically have three recruit and five attack. Three recruit, five, well with five attack we're going to go ahead and take out the angel card. Because it's cost us five because we're in the light. Uh, you add the dark value to this, but it's five. Cool, so we take this out. Boom, and because we took it out here in Sunnydale High, the light goes up one right on. We still have three recruit, and with three recruit, I think we're going to go ahead and get the faith card. Firecracker, you may advance the dark if you do KO a card in hand, or your discard pile. And it's two recruit, so yeah, we'll go with that one. And immediately replaced, oh, of course, with, ooh, I like these, another... Another spirit guy. Draw a card, gain a courage token. All right, and that's it for our turn. I'm gonna dump off our cards, drop six new ones. One, two, three, four, five, six. And of course, the name of the game is we have to attack and defeat Angel four times. We need nine attack to do it and haven't been able to get there yet. So we got spirit guide, a wound, watchers, uh, we survive real top card. You can KO the top card of your deck. Um, yeah, looks like lots of recruit. Um, real top card of your deck, you may KO it. Uh, if you KO a wound, advance the light. Oh boy. Okay, so that's going to be for next turn. Over we go now to player two. All right, player two, yes, the first thing we do is we grab a lovely villain card, and it is, oh, another one of the Vampire Initiates. Ambush, capture a bystander. So this angel card goes to here, boom, and they capture it. Better not be Clem again. This time, Lily. Uh, okay, cool. All right, well, they capture Lily. Three attack, and... It is player two's turn, so let's see what we have for player two. Watchers, we have Faith, draw a card, cool. Two attack, so we got two, four, we got five attack, which means they can take out both of those. Oh, sweet. Do we have any synergies at all? Ah, uh, yes, we have Green Fist, and then we have Green Fist. KO a wound from your discard pile. Well, sadly, uh, we don't have a discard pile. Actually, no, we can't. Well, what is the... Ah! Okay. Can advance the dark to get an extra attack, but we don't need it. We don't need it. Um, KO. So this KO wound from your discard pile. Well, we don't have... A, uh, does any discard pile from your discard pile? Well, I guess we can't really get synergies, but we have five attack, three recruit. For, the, for two attack, we're going to go ahead and get this card. Uh, once again, we're in the light, so it's only a two... Uh, so yeah, boom, done, and we advance the light one up to three. We're getting close to gaining a courage. Move to light one. We have three attack left, so yes, we'll go ahead and play the three attack, which means we get this, and we get Lily. And Lily says, draw two cards, then discard a card. Draw two cards and then discard one card. Draw two cards and discard a card. All right, so to keep things organized, we played that card. We played this card and we played that one so this is would be our hand so we drew two cards and we discard a card well we might as well discard our attack because uh, we have one attack left it's going to do us no good so we'll discard the attack leaving us four recruit and I think with four recruit I'm going to go ahead and they're going to go ahead and get this one spirit guide I like this draw card gate a courage token really cool card for three and that's basically the end yep it's going to be the end of our player two's turn. So we're going to grab six new car or cards for next hand. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Let's see what we get. We have the blood cry. It's three, four watchers and a wound. Oh, oh, KL card in your hand or discard pile. Oh, we don't have synergies. Urgh. Well, 
Okay, but we do have, uh, if you have two or more courage tokens, we don't. So we're going to have one, two, three. We're only going to have four recruit to attack. That's a pretty sucky hand. <laughs> well, we'll see. All right, over we go again back to player one. Okay, player one. Yes, indeed. Villain card. Drusilla. Ooh. Oh. Ambush. Each player discards their hand and draws one less card than they discarded. <laughs> Let me read that in each player. So they discard their hand and draw one less card than they discard. Oh, come off of it. Drusilla, you swine. All right, well, let's do player two first. So they're going to discard their hand. One, two, three, four, five, six cards. So they're going to discard their hand and draw five. One, two. We've got a shuffle. Uh, man, that's a nasty little ambush ability. Nasty. One, two, three, four, five. Well, maybe it might even be better than what player two had anyway. All right. That's our hand. We'll take a look at that here in a second. Oh, the same thing with player one. One, two, three, four, five, six cards discarded. Going to drop five. One, two, three, four, five. Well, not good. And this player one's turn. They have, um, all right, they've got two recruit, uh, two initiates, and reveal the top three cards of your deck. Draw all watchers and potential slayers. We're playing that, of course, first. Top three, of course, we have two. So we're gonna um, we're gonna get that. That's on the top of the deck. I got a shuffle. Uh, top of the deck. Draw all watchers. Potential slayer. So that one is on top. All right. And so the third card would be oh another watcher. Cool. All right. Well, kind of kind of helped a bit. Uh, but we don't have synergies for this. Otherwise, that would have been really cool because it would have meant that every one of our gray cards would get plus one attack. Unfortunately, we don't have the luxury. So all we're sitting with for player one's hand is two attack, which I'm not gonna do anything. Why do I keep forgetting to replace the cards here? Ooh, a five. Ooh, nice. Stoicism. Uh, reveal cards from the deck until you reveal a card that costs more than one. Draw it, KO all wounds reveal this way. Mm, nice, and three attack. All right, so bottom line is we're just sitting here with four recruit, four recruit and two attack. I wonder if we should go ahead. Uh, actually, this was better than that one. We're gonna go for three, we're gonna get this one. Real top card of your deck, if it's a uh, book or a um, courage token card, gain a courage token. All right, and it's worth two recruits. So we're gonna get that one for three, leaving us one recruit, but we won't be able to get it. All right, well, that kind of messed up our hand, the Drusilla. Uh, but we do now, for our next episode, we'll get to draw six cards. One, two, three, four, five, and six. And we'll see what we get. What's going to be for next time? We have Spirit Guide, a couple of initiates for attack, a wound, uh, and advance the light. Okay, well, it's all good. All good. Draw a card, gain courage token. Ooh, nice. All right. Over we go to the end of the episode today. Back to player number two. All right, player two, what do we have here? Probably something not good. Oh, it's another, it's another angel card, Mr. Broody Pants. All right, Drusilla's there. Can we come up with five attack to take her out? What, what's her fight ability when you take her out? Advance the dark and KO a wound from your hand or discard pile. Okay, we can live with that. All right, uh, what do we have for player two's hand? We have the faith, I don't know, draw a card. We have two draws a card. You may KO a Watcher's in your hand. Oh, okay, this is actually good. You may KO a Watcher in your hand if you do gain a potential Slayer and place it in your hand. So we're going to KO the Watcher, and then we're going to put a potential Slayer in our hand by playing this card. Right on. Uh, and then we get draw a card, gain a Courage token. So we're going to draw a card, uh, and we gain a Courage token. Nice. Player two. All right, carrying on. Draw a card. You may advance the dark if you do get plus one attack. Do we need it? Um, first of all, we're going to draw the card. We're going to see what it is. Ooh, nice. We're, we don't have to advance the dark to get plus one attack, or will it help us? Two, that would be three, four, five, six, seven. That would be seven. Seven, seven attack, five. 
We could get the angel. Oh, I think we're going to do that. It's going to be draw a card. Oh, hang on. Yeah, gain a courage token. So we drew a card. We drew this one. You may advance the dark if you do get plus one attacks. So we're going to advance to the dark. We're putting it at light two, which is all good. So this is going to be three attack, four or five. You may gain a wound to place it on top of your deck if you do gain plus two attack. We're not going to. Three, four, five, six, seven attack, and two recruit. Two recruit will get Prophecy Girl. And for that, uh, yes, two recruit will get Prophecy Girl. And we have seven attack. So for five attack, we'll do this right now. Advance the dark. I KO a wound from your hand or discard pile. And unfortunately, we don't have any, but we do get rid of Drusilla. So that's good. And we're going to advance the light one because of this. We're in Sunnydale High. And then the remaining two attack, we're going to take this because we're in the light. Uh, and we're going to get the angel card. Boom. And yes, yeah, so we have to replace this with, ooh, death is your gift. Uh, two attack, dark, you get plus one for each villain. Oh, for each villain in Sunnydale? Ooh, okay, not bad. Well, that was a pretty good turn for player two. Hope I haven't messed anything up. Once again, check the comments, because yes, I do screw things up sometimes. One, two, three, four, five, and six. This will be player two's hand for next episode. Uh, a watcher, a watcher, blood cry. Initiative soldiers. Advance the light, Mr. Rudy Pants, and uh, not terrible. We have two or more Courage Tokens. Ooh, I have one. And if we play that first, we'll have two. So this would be then... Uh, actually, not bad, not bad. Okay. All right, that's it for today. So thanks so much for watching along. It's your comments, subscriptions, likes. This is Legendary Buffy, which I haven't played in, I think it was five or six years. <laughs> We're back at it again. We're up against Angelus. Big bad boy. We need nine attack, though, to hit, even try to hit him. And his special ability, when you try to attack him, you can't have any wounds in your discard pile. Because if you do, you can't take him on. So, there we go. And we have Road to Damnation, which means if we get five of the Angel cards discarded, or it are off the board, uh, escaped, we lose the game immediately. I think it was five. Yeah, well, five of the Chosen Hero cards have escaped. You lose. So, that's how we lose. Got to hit him four times to win. Can we do it? I have no idea. So thanks so much. We'll see you next time. Continuation, Buffy the Vampire Slayer Legendary. And uh, I'll see you tomorrow. Alrighty, a couple little corrections here right at the end of the episode. Yes, we had Drusilla, and I forgot here. It said, advance the dark and KO a wound from your hand or discard pile. Player two took out Drusilla. Uh, however, we didn't have a wound in our hand or discard pile, but we could advance the dark. And so uh, we shouldn't be sitting at light three. We should be sitting at light two. And one thing I forgot long ago, oh my God, long, long ago, is when our first angel card escaped, whenever a villain escapes and he's considered a villain, we're to KO a uh, character in the library here that is worth six or less. And I didn't do that. And because so much time has passed, I don't know what if, what we should do. I think we're just going to leave it. Just keeping in mind that that's how that's supposed to work. Whatever villains escape, you're supposed to KO a character worth six or less from the library. Oh well, messed that up. We're not going to worry about it right now. All right, we'll see you tomorrow for continuation. Legendary Buffy against Angelus.